I have never heard better sound, you know? And this guy is an audio nerd and you really wanna buy stuff from a guy who's an audio nerd. Hey, what's happening? My name is Sean and I'm the father of Flare at Helmet Flare. We make decorative attachments for helmets. So this would be bike helmets, motorcycle helmets, things like that. And we find ourselves at events oftentimes and we wanna make a party. So to make a good party, you need to have killer sound. You need to have really good speakers. So uh, we've always had these tiny little junky Bluetooth speakers. So we really wanted to step our game up. Uh, so we picked up this party box made by JBL. It's a nice speaker and it's super duper loud. And we brought it to A Basin and it was fun, super fun. And we thought it was great until we had a speaker off with the in-phase speaker, this fella right here. The Party Box 100 next to this thing, it's not even a contest. So we went back to Walmart and we returned that JBL Party Box 100. Sorry, JBL, I know you tried, A for effort. But this thing creamed you. Why did it cream you? Let's go through this wonderful piece of artwork that makes the most fantastic music in the history of humankind. First of all, the finish is incredible. He does rabbit, rabbit jigs, what he said? rabbit joints on all this stuff no screws nothing it's clean and you could do custom laser engraving he'll do this for you this is our brand um, this is our mascots here on either side we also have another another one we bought a whole pair this guy here we got Zane on the top now what's rad about this speaker is that these dials are so satisfying to turn they're real smooth they feel like a really high quality guitar amp you know what I'm talking about. It just feels good. I mean, you never see this kind of quality on a portable Bluetooth speaker. Your buttons are real buttons. And just that is so satisfying. So we've got our bass and treble and then our volume. And the volume, it goes to 11. Ridiculous. Let's go over the back, shall we? The fun stuff. This is your little charging port. If you're connected by Bluetooth and you want to cancel and disconnect, that's your cancel button. Here's your battery. And cool thing is that when you've got a pair of these, you can pair them. And here's our outbound, eighth inch little headphone jack plug, goes to the other unit. And you can have that by mono or you can have that by stereo based on this little button here, which is pretty cool. Here's our powered USB outs. And for us, talking to Chris, who's the audio engineer mastermind behind this whole project. We were like, hey, we really wanna use these to go and do performances because we're an ensemble and we wanna be amped and that'd be super fun. And we would love to have microphones and a guitar and a mandolin hooked up to these things. So he did a bunch of research and found this super killer little mixing board that is powered by USB. So what's cool is that the outbound power USB here goes into that mixer, which is about this big, super portable, cute little guy. And then now we're able to do all that we could, all that anybody could do with an on-site system in a full-on PA, and it sounds insane. So let's check out the bottom. Here's just some info. You've got your, you know, your user manual, and then this will get you to the website. It's kind of nifty. These six screws are gonna allow you to pop this open. And if at any point in the future, let's say your battery goes bad, or you wanna, I don't know, reprogram your crossover unit or whatever, you can, right? So this is, this is uh, the ability to maintain this as a consumer is the dopest thing. So it might be a little bit more expensive than something like uh, a JBL or a Bose speaker, but to be able to maintain it is amazing. Not to mention, I have never heard better sound, you know? And this guy is an audio nerd and you really wanna buy stuff from a guy who's an audio nerd. So check them out, inphase.us, their website. They make insane stuff. If you don't believe it's worth the money, you really just have to listen to it. And I would play it for you now, but chances are you'd be listening to it through really crappy speakers, so it's kind of pointless. Uh, so uh, that's your tour of the in phase. Hope you enjoyed. Have a killer day.